is my shot to get Leo DiCaprio to call all of us on the couch. Earth Day is tomorrow, and one of the biggest celebrity climate change champions, wait for it, Leo. And he's being branded a hypocrite. While the actor preaches about being an echo warrior, or is it eco, and even <laughs> leads climate change summits at the United Nations, he's also reportedly a frequent flyer of private jets. Newly leaked Sony emails reportedly show the A-list actor spent more than $200,000 on six private jet flights in just six weeks last year. An environmental group called out DiCaprio last year for taking private flights and fuel-guzzling mega yachts. Well, what are you supposed to do if you're Leo and you're hot? I mean, what do you do? Do you take a coach <laughs> Great flight? question, like, Harris. Do do? It's a great question. This is why I don't take private jets and hang out with supermodels. <laughs> oh, is that why? That's why. <laughs> you just cracked the case. Oh my goodness. And, you know, I have single handedly blown a hole in the ozone with all the hairspray that I use. <laughs> so, this is why I don't get involved in environmental causes. And you know what? Leo probably shouldn't either. Do you what? think Leo should back out of this guy? Just say, you know what? You got me. I'm, no more causes for me. <laughs> no, he won't. And he'll assuage his guilt by saying, but I'm bringing awareness to the issue and mm. I'm paying for carbon offsets. I mean, Hollywood hypocrisy is dog bites man, right? It happens every day. We're not surprised by it. I have to say, the only reason we're even discussing it mm -hmm. is because Sony was illegally hacked mm -hmm. and that stinks and I hate that all these revelations because it's catnip for us in the media we talk about it yeah. talk about it but yeah. this information was accessed illegally yeah well and it's created as you say a lot of gotcha moments what's wrong with first class like I whenever I get upgraded I'm so happy in first class is is that <laughs> is that not good enough anymore I mean what, why does he need to go on a private jet? That reminds I mean, me of that scene I'm out of science. Oh, wait a minute. When Louis uh, drives of everything. She's like, gosh, everything is different. Rach, in first now class. you're talking like a liberal, right? A one percenter, right? Hating the people who take the private jets. Hey, if no. you're earning it, take a private jet. I'm not, just, okay, don't that's, that's, everybody, just don't but, lecture everybody else. Just don't lecture everyone else about yeah. taking But he them. got an award from the Clinton Foundation, of Ooh. all places, for being for a great... Algeria. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I see what Andrea is saying. It's like fine. Don't beat up on people because they have the bank to go do whatever they yeah. want. But just don't be a hypocrite. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like if, if he if he invited me and my family on his yacht, would in, you go? In St. Bart's, absolutely. <laughs> because I'm not a crazy person. Leonardo <laughs> <laughs> DiCaprio and, and my my onesie thong. That would be so much fun. I mean, of course, my husband and my girls would be there, and it would be mildly inappropriate. And your friends. <laughs> I would be careful. celebrating his success. That's the difference between me and the rest of Leo's friends. I have God, a little why does he need to be careful. Will you bring your thong on my rowboat? <laughs> Leo DiCaprio has a been asked sketchy that question, history on uh, ships. It's a Titanic joke. We can talk about it. <laughs> no, I mean, it like a blank stare on my face. That is so embarrassing. It's all right. You're right. No, it's very funny. I'm sorry you had to explain it to me. Okay, moving on. No personalized gifts and receipts must be included. Coming up, the growing reaction online to a first birthday party invite that's going viral because of the parents' list of demands to the guests.